Sire, victory. Despite heavy losses, we now control the trade quarter. Excellent. What news from De Wet? He's dead. Cut down by that godless butcher, the Witcher. Useless De Wet. Have the town criers informed the people Adder has become a Strigger? Yes, but the Witcher found the beast. Geralt of Rivia. Only he stands between me and... We must fan the flames of chaos. Release more of our experiments, and let the elves wreak havoc. Grandmaster, I must protest. As a nobleman and representative of... Enough. Give the people more food, and tell them any God-fearing human can find shelter at the castle of the Order of the Flaming Rose. Adalbert, I thank you for your loyal service. Take him away. A new era dawns. An era of superhumans. None will stop me. I appoint you my new adjutant. Know your assignment? Kill the Witcher. Then go. Geralt, you've arrived at a moment that should be called nothing short of historic. Stop being dramatic and tell me what's happening. All right, let me tell you quickly before Yavin's arrested. He won't be as long as I'm here. The king will be forced to acknowledge me as a temporary ally. You sure? Foltest already has an ally in Radovid of Rodania. We can't pass through the city without the king's consent. You're still a wanted elf. Then let us speak to your king. Welcome, Witcher. Sire. We have several things to discuss. Stop deliberating, son. We need to put out the fire in this whorehouse. You'll get the princess's hand, and if life has taught me anything, half the kingdom as soon as I'm gone. As for de Aldersburg, we need to be rid of him. The Witcher will slay him. What? Relax, we'll pay you as much as you want. I'm a Witcher, not a hit. All right, <clears throat> 10,000. Isn't that a bit much? Come on, Foltest, the kingdom's worth a lot more than that. Yes, I suppose the boy's right. But you shall take home 8,000. It's a deal. So, we're all agreed. Radovid, your armies must subdue the Order in Redania and in the north of my lands. My armies will embark on a mission of fraternal assistance. I don't want any fucking fraternal assistance. The phrase rubs me the wrong way. You are to smash the Knights of the Order and withdraw. Relax, Foltest. My children will rule this land. I don't intend to destroy it. <clears throat> Forgive me, Your Majesties, but I feel it's time I... One more thing, Witcher. Let's talk politics. And don't you dare mention neutrality. Judging by your company, you're already involved. Possibly up to your nose. To the average pleb in the street, the Order is fighting my armies. But make no mistake. This is a confrontation between me and the Grand Master. That ambitious fanatic... ...directed all of Salamandra's actions and intentionally provoked the uprising. What do you mean? I thought you'd be interested, sire. Very interested, and that means the Order is the enemy, is that clear? As day. The Order is the enemy, not the Scoia'tael. You're getting it, but only if those long-eared bastards stop burning my city and slaying my merchants. Did you hear that, Yavin? And if those long-eared bastards cease, can they then, as fighters for freedom and decency, count on the King's clemency? Or even amnesty? Only those that lay down their arms. And not all can be forgiven. The people would not understand. Yavin, you must disappear. Go away somewhere far. I shall restrain my officers from hunting you for a few days. You'll restrain them longer and instruct them not to look hard. In gratitude, for we'll rid you of Jacques de Aldersburg. Sire, one other matter. How is Ada feeling? Much better than she was as a strigger, yet she won't be herself again for some time. Witcher, how can I thank you? I'm glad Ada is alive and well. Can you ensure that the Witcher's friends will be the same, sire? Yes, that's something I can promise. Witcher, I wish to know who was behind all this. De Wet transformed the princess. He was acting on behalf of the Order. The bastard! If I could get my hands on him! Those responsible assumed your position would be undermined if the princess wreaked havoc as a strigger. De Wet has been punished. I'm glad to hear it. Now go. Vizima is burning, fighting rages. You won't have an easy time of it. People see witchers as monster slayers. Rightly so. Few know we draw greater satisfaction from removing a curse or a spell.
swords are a final resort. As long as there was a chance I could save the princess, I had to try. It was worth it. Then Bold Foltest uttered these words. Virtuous Radovid. What the hell is that? I'm trying to keep a faithful and accurate record of these events. He said, stop deliberating, son. We need to put out the fire in this whorehouse. Geralt, you have no sense of poetry. There's the truth of time and the truth of legend. You'll never change. The pen is mightier than the sword, and you'll never change either. Off to save the world again when nobody's asked you. Oui. De nouveau, accès pour vraiment la toute dernière fois à mon inventaire. Oh putain. You were wrong to cross me. Do you enjoy working for a madman? Do you murder for pleasure or simply to follow orders? I need not listen to you. You're not even human. I'm sorry, Siegfried. <laughs> Come inside. It's safer. Greetings. Others stricken by war have sought shelter here. Eh, c'est Vaskia, du Marais. The squirrels and the order. Those dry ones disturb our swamp. Between a rock and a hard place, huh? I had a dream, white-haired one. Your destiny will be fulfilled. I come to tell you. Mistake not the stars with their reflection in a pond's surface. I'll remember that. Oh, you l'ermite. You here? On an important mission for the king. Praiseworthy. I too wish to offer Foltest my services as an advisor in these difficult times. Sadly, I could not get through burning Vizima. I have learned much about a phenomenon of interest to you. The Wild Hunt in folk culture. The king of the Wild Hunt embodies death. He is the one who takes away souls. He is oft considered as the tool of destiny. The Wild Hunt is an omen of war and tragedy. It has oft been seen recently near Vizima. Beware. Dans le folklore européen au sens large, il y a plusieurs mythes de la chasse sauvage. Elle est souvent dirigée par Wotan, c'est le dieu germanique Odin. Dans ces mythes-là, elle est annonciateuse de mauvais présages, que ce soit la guerre, la peste, etc. Ça servait à expliquer des phénomènes comme les tempêtes, les migrations d'oiseaux, ou encore une troupe de cavaliers qui s'est lancée dans la plaine, quoi. Et dans le monde du Witcher, il traverse les mondes sous forme spectrale. C'est plus pratique que sous forme physique. No, Ithlene's prophecy. Not exactly. The war with Nilfgaard proved it, for Ithlene foretold the blood of Ensaid, of elves, would drench the land. People thought the age of the sword and axe, the age of the wolf's blizzard, had arrived. Know the rest? Not sure. Then listen. The time of white frost and white light approaches. The time of madness and disdain. Ted Dayred, the end of ages. The world will perish in frost. I don't care about prophecies. I care about the lives of ordinary people. I know you care about people. I saw calm and happy with the captain of the guards. You know they got married? Nice to hear. Thanks to you, Witcher. I heard you cast a spell on Vincent. That poor girl deserved a little happiness. Poor girl? Carmen endured a lot. She lived in the outskirts. Her father was a priest of the Eternal Fire, a damnable man of religion. When Carmen got pregnant, he cast her out. She went to Vizima. You know how that ended. I didn't know. Greetings! How did you get here? Don't you see? Knights, soldiers, and Skyatel run through the streets, cutting down who they can. I am a traitor to all of them. And all their heads are filled with prophecies, destinies, strange signs, and other nonsense. No one to talk to. Sorry to hear that, but I need to go. Farewell. Tobias mourns his daughters. The Fisher King netted a water nymph. Julian left for Kovir. The Temple School? Boring. Ça va nous permettre d'en savoir plus sur le destin des habitants d'eau trouble. Witcher! Good to see you. I see war is to your liking, Vitala. I no longer need to hide in the cemetery. It's safer here. I come out at night, find food in the streets. Can't complain. The inhabitants of this home have no objection? They fear me. The little brat comes alone, talks without end. <laughs> 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 
there were monsters in the cellar. I'll die anyway. They'll find me. They'll get me. Calm down. How do we get out? Through the window. Hold, in the name of King Foltest. Master Geralt, didn't recognize you. What's the situation, Captain? The Knights of the Order prepare to attack. Oh, putain, let's go! Is there a safer way to the monastery? There's another path. Through the sewers. Dangerous. I have a key. Take it. Thank you. You won't... Azugl. Alors Azugl, c'est un monstre qui s'est accommodé des humains en fait. Il se nourrit des déchets qu'il y a dans les égouts. Il peut se reproduire rapidement en plus parce qu'il est hermaphrodite. Gérald en avait déjà tué un dans les livres, c'était à Aed Ginvael. Et c'est d'ailleurs cette ville où réside Istred. Gérald y séjourné avec Yennefer. Oh non, il y a mes Tekurasai Zoglusan They pray instead of fighting fires. Duan. Have sympathy. They've lost their homes and loved ones. Prayer helps them accept their fate. Hmm. Many elves mourn today too. Nous sommes pas si différents que ça, Yévin. Courage les gars On arrive Je vais sauver le monde et je reviens Bloody ass He got me You're bleeding heavily. Not good. Go on. The Squirtel will care for me. Kill that bastard de Eldersburg. Go I'll come back for you. N'inquiète frater. Behold my people. They feast at my table, find warmth at my fire, and glow with happiness to be separated from the turmoil of war. You're deluded if you think the sight of women and children will make me leave you alone. I do not intend to deceive you. The white frost approaches, a cataclysm that will bury the world beneath snow and ice. Each night, I dream of icy wastelands and the death of the old civilizations. I've heard Ethelina's prophecy. The cataclysm is unavoidable. Kings prefer to wage local wars to expand their influence, while elves have become terrorists fighting for a lost cause. The world needs a savior, a man of the moment, someone to kindle the flame in people's hearts. Ah, you, savior of the world. Come, I will show you something. Humans are weak, frail, and inclined toward evil. I shall create a new man, perfect, tempered in the eternal fire. Finished? Because if you are... You doubt me? I do not blame you. I had my doubts too. Yet now, my vision is strong. Hey, you. Finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Hello, monsieur. Hello. Et maintenant, à Paris.
Now that you have seen the ice encased towers of Vizima, do you understand? You're rambling to Aldersburg. What do you want? This is the future. The White Frost has destroyed human civilization. This is the end of time. Save your rhetoric for the plebs. Understand. The Order and Salamandra acted only to save humanity. Every criminal claims a higher cause. You lack humility. Time for a lesson in some. Alors ici il y a effectivement les listes de Temeria. Après ça c'est pas le futur tel quel. C'est surtout la vision qui est née de l'esprit de Jack Dalzesberg. Et vu que c'est sa vision il peut la manipuler à volonté. Donc il va pouvoir nous faire tout ce qu'il veut là-dedans. C'est sa croyance du futur qui correspond à la prophétie d'Itlin. Le temps du froid blanc et de la lumière blanche. Et vu que c'est la dernière zone du jeu, les développeurs ils avaient pour mission de laisser une forte impression aux joueurs. C'est pour ça qu'ils ont fait une immense zone de glace comme ça. Et il y a les ruines de bâtiments qu'on a déjà vu normalement. How did you get here? You're stronger than the Grand Master thought. You summoned me. How? The Grand Master invited you into a vision of the future enclosed in his mind. Yet you brought your own visions and specters. So this isn't real? It's more than a dream. Should you die here, your death will be very real. I shall accompany you, assist you. But only a blizzard follows us with nothing beyond it but death. Elle applique le bouclier d'Alzur sur moi. Je vous présente les Têtes de Mort. C'était des créatures primitives de la dernière ère glaciaire. Une sorte d'animaux préhistoriques. Et fort heureusement, ils ont complètement disparu à l'époque du Witcher. You haven't changed a bit, Witcher. Again, you emerge from nowhere to kill humans. What humans? As always, you're perplexing. Behold the remains of humanity. Ape men, wretched creatures worthy of disdain. Some my own great-grandchildren. They're human? The White Frost has stripped humanity of its luxurious robes. All that's left are beasts that think only of eating and procreating. They are human no longer. Their base instincts drive them like the lynch mob from which you saved me. I'm grateful. Take my gift. Mm, merci. I see you have met our degenerate great-grandchildren. Do you understand now why you cannot oppose my plan? You have yet to say how all this ice justifies your crimes. Many of the gifted foresaw the white frost. Global cooling is this world's destiny. Why fight it then? You always believed man makes his own destiny. I seek to change all humanity's fate. You robbed humanity of its right to decide. You understand nothing. Geralt. I hear the wails of those who perished, hear their cries, and you will know my pain. La chasse sauvage, carrément. You cannot stop this, Witcher. Death follows you. On the fragile. You killed them, though they were not guilty. They did not wish to die of the cold, nor to live on as spectres. No one gave them a choice. Was I supposed to let myself get killed? That's not my style, Teruvio. None of us choose the path we must follow. I understand. You had to fight for dignity. You had no choice. Each does, as destiny ordains. Before you proceed on the dangerous path before you accept this gift. I don't know what this is, but it's kind of hot. Attends, j'ai essayé un truc. The human nations can only survive the cold through a mass exodus south. With you leading them? I'm prepared to do so. I see the future. I command respect. I would rule well. Of course, I had to get rid of any standing in the way, especially non-humans. Why so obsessed about other races? Non-humans, their extinction is not a goal, but a means. Since you detest humans so, I'll leave you with my no longer human serfs. You have much in common. You should get along. 
Fun fact, les arches de glace, au départ, ils en ont fait un prototype en argile. The order could have saved humanity. A coup d'état, murder, experiments on children, too high a price. Why am I talking to you? You claim to protect humans, yet you've thrown them to the beast. Why? Because you're not human yourself. I should have seen your true face and killed you when I had the chance. Siegfried, tu dépasses les morts. Oh, tu vas où là? Oh, tu vas pas sur ma meuf là? Look, Alvin. It's just an illusion, Triss. How stubborn you are. I could use you to shepherd my sheep during the first years of winter. I doubt you mean it. You stole our secrets from Kaer Morin, used them for the worst ends. I needed witches, but knew the secrets of mutation had been lost. You witches had it all, but lacked courage and vision. I merely did what you desired in your hearts. You took them as if they were your own. You're a thief, a hypocrite. Are you incapable of seeing the golden path of my dreams? My knights will explain it to you in a way you will understand. Boy, in a morrow. Look, Geralt. Humans, monsters. Easy to mistake one for the other. True, your highness. I should know, wouldn't you say? The Grand Master is clearly a madman. Even I wouldn't dare pursue a plan like his. We must stop him. Milady, your wish is my command. You have class, a rare quality. I wish to fight alongside you. Call it a whim. of the vision he controls all you must go on alone maître sorceleur je suis niveau max je vais prendre une forêt de maribor ouais un filtre de pétri pour améliorer les signes saule pourquoi pas tiens et euh, de l'hirondelle euh, je vais mettre carrément la rune perrune dessus hein. oh yeah Fun fact, c'est la cour du château de l'ordre de la Rose Ardente. Version prophétie d'Itlin. By pursuing me, you proved me right. You faced the dangers that humanity faces and survived. Jacques de Aldersburg, your dream is over. Patience. You may yet change your mind. Imagine thousands traversing an icy wasteland. Could you defend them? You and a handful of witches ridden with doubt, like Berengar? Impossible. Only the greater brothers can do that, but they need to be taught and led. They need you. I also have an offer. Surrender. Withdraw your mutants. Humble yourself before the king. You'll save many lives. How confident you seem. A painful lesson awaits. <laughs> Salamandra is dying, soon to be a memory. Salamandra means nothing. It was but a particle of chaos, the tool of the madman you just slew. Your past, your destiny, the reasons for your resurrection, all remain unknown. Words, words, words. Let me remind you, there is death, but there is also choice. 
I shall not look back. I shall find Salamandra and fulfill my destiny. You were wrong. I come for the soul of someone whose path often crossed yours as it was written. You may fight me, but the end will always be the same. Death. The question is, whose? I cannot be killed. You can delay your end, but it will come. Let us tend to the one already dead. Reflect on your deeds, Witcher. I stood near you when you arrived at Kaer Morhen, an omen of its downfall. I observed as you judged the villagers of the outskirts, leaving only blood and fire behind you. You brought death upon Raymond, endangered Shani mindful only of your goals. Chaos followed in your wake. You slaughtered dozens with your witcher's sword. You threw gold to the Skoyatal, fueling new massacres. You left Vizima in chaos, only to bring destruction upon murky waters. Every one of your decisions brought further devastation. Each choice you made led to greater evil. How did you feel when your elven friends set fire to Vizima and slaughtered Duan? Stop. Do not deny it, Witcher. You are my greatest champion, a perfect means of destruction. Wherever you walk, death and chaos follow. Now, as it was years ago, accept it. Do not fight it. Give up to me yet another man you destroyed. Jacques de Aldersberg is mine. You dare to oppose me? I sense your weakness as your life seeps from your wounds. With every drop, death draws nearer. You stand no chance against me. Tous les choix que t'as fait durant tout le jeu, ils sont concentrés dans l'épilogue, dans cette partie-là. Je trouve ça fort. Les paroles du roi de la chasse. A devastation. Each choice you made led to greater evil. C'était dans un trailer de The Witcher 3. Every decision you make will bring devastation. Each choice will lead to a greater evil. Et moi j'en ai des frissons en fait. Mais pas la cam là, mais j'ai des frissons. <rire> bon. Va chier, Aydin. Never. This is between him and me. You aim to kill him anyway. True, but for my reasons, and they're nothing to you. Clear off while you can. Go before it's too late. You want to fight me? So be it. Your flight from death ends here. Draw your sword. I was afraid you'd suggest Mario Kart. You motherfucker. That sword is for monsters. You're awake, Geralt. I was getting worried. Dandelion? Where's the Grand Master? A few steps away. He's dead. For a minute there, I thought you were gone too. Hardly a pleasant nap. Was I out long? Long enough. The Order's been smashed into bits and Foltest has regained power. And Yavin? 
He was here a second ago, keeping an eye on you till I arrived. Then he had to go. Foltest will let him disappear. No doubt. After all, the non-humans tipped the scales in Foltest's favor. What about you? Did you succeed? Yes. I'll take the final element from Jacques and close this chapter. Alors, ça vous dit rien, ça C'était exactement le lieu de la bataille finale. Le secret de Kermorène. La fin de quelque chose, c'est toujours le début de quelque chose d'autre. Something ends, something begins. You know what I found on the Grand Master? A dimeridium pendant. The one you gave Alvin? I don't know. It looks the same, but older. He must have worn it under his armor for years. A true keepsake, perhaps. Maybe it was his way of repelling hostile magic. Or it was there to control inborn abilities, unrelenting visions. That's something we'll never know. It doesn't matter. Jacques de Aldersburg, if that was his name, is dead. End of story. What's next, Geralt? What do you mean? Come now. You've recovered what was stolen, punished those who hurt you, you played politics and dismantled conspiracies. You've loved, you've killed, you've come a long way, Geralt. What do you intend to do now? Hmm. Only now do I feel my new life beginning. Born anew, baptized in blood and fire. A new ballad? Sounds too pompous, Dandelion. Take a look around. Life is simple, unpredictable, and beautiful. That's something new. You returned from the netherworld, got entangled in a real mess. You faced beasts and bastards who did you harm. And you're telling me life is beautiful? You're exaggerating again. Something ends, something begins. I'll take the last of the stolen secrets, take a deep breath, and move on. What can I say? Godspeed on your path, Witcher. The bloody fighting in Vizima revealed Jack de Aldersburg's madness. People ceased trusting knights of the order, began treating them like enemies. Foltest took advantage and limited the order's power. He forgave the non-humans their mutiny as they assisted him in quelling the order's rebellion. Yet the king's mercy was short-lived, and it could not quell disdain and hatred. Scoia'tael units soon reappeared along Forest Road. Yavin's fame as the one who had defeated the Order drew more elven youth to his cause. The sorceresses failed to gain influence over Foltest. The wartime chaos brought only misery. In time, all returned to normal. Both the righteous and the villainous survived. Few knew what had really happened in those days in Vizima. They were those who destiny had brought together with Geralt of Rivia. Yet they chose to remain silent. What then happened to the Witcher? That is a different tale entirely. Cinématique de fin réalisée par Platige Image également. La scène a été complètement inspirée par la version in-game. Temeria and Redania are allies, thanks in no small part to you. For your toil, a worthy pouch of gold. Your Highness. Master. Farewell, sire.
Sorceleur.